Now all new at 10, Elvis fans paying their respects to the king of rock and roll tonight as the annual candlelight vigil lights up at Graceland. They come from all over the world, many taking part in a week-long event to honor Elvis Presley, who died in Memphis 34 years ago. News Channel 3's Natasha Chen is live at Graceland tonight. Natasha. Well, Richard, organizers at one point were concerned there'd be fewer people coming this year because of the headlines a few months ago that it was flooding in Memphis. Turns out that didn't stop the most devoted fans from coming. What you see around are some of the 30 or 40,000 fans here this week to pay homage to music royalty. Elvis fans are like none other, at times loud. I, I'm curious to know, are there any Elvis Presley fans in the audience tonight? And then solemnly quiet. They each have their own story for why they're here. As a kid, I drove my folks nuts on which Elvis t-shirt to wear every day. Then when I go, which button, my dad said, just put them all on. So I've been collecting them since 1964. And I put patches on the back because it got painful when I sat down. Ann McLean used to follow Elvis like a full-time job and shows people the picture she took with him at a gas station down the street. She's been to every vigil since his death. For veterans, they'll tell you one thing is different this year. A lot cooler, a lot cooler nice. this year, yes. Perfect. He's shining down on us. The Wallachs are from Illinois and converted an old Beanie Baby shelf into an Elvis shrine. It's their first time dressing up, but others have had some more practice. The landscape, you know, landscape is uh, making uh, Elvis clothes, you know. Yeah, I'm growing up with it and you just like it and, uh, yeah, can't get enough of it, you know. Love to see it. Still, some don't buy. They make their own Elvis outfits. The Roberts from Oxford, England will renew their vows at the Graceland Chapel this week for their 25th anniversary. <laughs> So excited, um, overwhelmed at being here, uh -huh. which is wonderful. <laughs> My eyes are warm, but I think it's the sun. <laughs> That's the thing. Emotions catch people off guard when they think of Elvis and how he's made their lives just a little brighter, whether they were admiring from afar, up close, or not even born yet. Great entertainer. Really made everybody feel like they were part of it. And they can all be a part of it again next year on the 35th anniversary of Elvis's death. Lisa Marie Presley sent a message to all the fans tonight thanking them for being here and telling them that next year she and her mother will join them in Memphis. Reporting live at Graceland, Natasha Chen, WREG, News Channel 3. Always fascinating. Good group out there today. Yes, indeed. And Natasha is now a fully initiated member of the That's News Channel right. 3 reporting staff. That's how we like to initiate our reporters. That's right. Like they need that experience. <laughs>